Good morning, lunatics. Welcome to Clear Lake. Today is the fourth and final day of practice out here on beautiful Clear Lake. This place is beautiful. The bugs are pretty gnarly though, I'm not gonna lie. But I'm looking forward to going fishing. Kind of found something out yesterday, so if you guys are just tuning into the series on this video, um, check back yesterday. Um, some of the fish catches on yesterday's video did not make the video because the cameras were off and everything. It was like 6.30 at night. But I think that that pattern that I found, even though it was late in the day, should hold up. Just need to go find out how to catch them in the morning and midday. Um, those fish should still be there. I think they're staging fish for the spawn. Um, it's April out here, so the spawn is, you know, right now, coming up it just kind of depends on the specific day everything's day by day right now looking forward to getting out here this video and this entire major league fishing mlf event here at clear lake the toyota series event is brought to you by gci outdoor six sense fishing waterland fishing optics and do it molds gci makes awesome outdoor chairs tables stadium seats stuff for camping stuff for beach days stuff for lake days they make awesome stuff head over to gci outdoor and use discount code mlf15 to save some money uh, you guys know everything about Sixth Sense. They make awesome fishing gear. Waterland is my sunglasses sponsor. These are my Waterlands I'm wearing right now. These are the Ashore Frames. Blue lenses, great for sight fishing. Discount code for them is Luna15. And then Do It Molds, if you want to make your own tackle, head over to doitmolds.com and check it out. Link to their website is in the, de the description of today's video. Uh, please use my affiliate link so that way they know that I sent you. I can get credit for that sale if you guys want to get into tackle making. But let's get into it. Let's go fishing. Let's catch some fish. It's kind of brutal out here today guys it's freezing cold it's windy i did not bring the right shoes for this i'm in sandals right now and it's cold i've had to add the blade jacket on i've had to add the buck and bass bibs it's just straight up cold out here guys and uh, the fishing is not good i've been doing different stuff than what i figured out yesterday and uh not panning out so i'm gonna have to i think adjust and start fishing some of the same types of things I fished yesterday just to find some new areas. Crappy. Not what we're looking for, guys. Not what we're looking for. So one of the unfortunate things is when you're out here, you can see on your graph and you just see some activity and you see some fish and stuff like that and you think they're bass and then they end up being those crappy. Still fun to catch them, keeps you kind of motivated, kind of makes you feel like you might be on the right track in terms of like color baits and stuff like that because the fish are, something's eating it. But um, just gotta start figuring these to fish out a little bit better. Um, I, I'm gonna probably go to the other side of the lake now and uh, check some of the stuff that I found yesterday evening just to see if I can get bit over there again and uh, hope for the best. like mentally fried right now I've been just fishing so hard for so many days in a row and uh, started doing some stuff I thought was gonna work and it did not pan out today um, there was no wind so to speak earlier in the day when I was doing it that might help things if we have a little bit of wind in the morning or midday tomorrow um, I think I'm gonna have to fish shallow 
and catch some of those bucks that are up on the beds and stuff like that tomorrow during the actual tournament. Um, so I got a lot of work to do to get prepared for tomorrow. Well guys, practice is over and uh, it was a grinder. I sucked out here today big time, or yesterday. It was in the morning, I didn't feel like filming uh, the outro for you guys. But uh, looks like we're gonna have to live and die with the with the ball head, the jerk bait, maybe the underspin, stuff like that. Uh, maybe a chatter bait if it's windy. But uh, we do have wind today, so that might help with some of the reaction stuff that I did find. Just don't know if it's gonna blow up my areas. But um, looking forward to the tournament. I have no idea what to expect, but practice is really pretty rough like you guys saw. Um, my third day of practice was my best day. We caught a bunch of fish that day. So hopefully we can uh, do some more of that and uh, bring some five big ones to the scales. So wish me luck and uh, thank you to GCI Outdoor, Six Sense Fishing, Waterland Fishing Optics and Dual Molds for really making this event possible. And guys, when I say that, I truly mean that. So please support those companies. And I'll see you guys bright and early in the morning. Or wait, no, it is morning. I forgot I told you guys that I filmed this the day of the tournament. So let's go. Next video you guys are gonna watch is day one, Clear Lake. Let's go.